hello, hello, everyone. I'm sorry about the wait here. Okay. Let's at least get that going. It's good to see you guys. Sorry about the long intro time here. I'm getting um, my pins set up for vaping both nicotine and marijuana here. So it's good to see you guys. Uh, Owen, Stubby, Patty, Frisky over there on Twitch. Um, there's another one on Twitch. These blue names, man, I cannot see them on this background. So I apologize for not being able to see your name. I wonder if I can fucking change that. Here, one second. Appearance. See if I can change my, yeah, colorized author names. There we go. Turn that off. Now I can see your name. Dark Magician. Good to see you. Yeah, don't forget the thumbs up. Gonna eat the ear. Yeah, there, there's something we could do. I don't, uh, actually typically do not, um, end up doing the fucking prize fighter thing until post game anyway. But, uh, we could check it out for sure. I'm getting this pen set up. So bear with me as I do that. Um, I've got the Seattle Supersonics infused battery here, which is uh, nice. I've had it before, but I lost it, so I had to grab a new one. Um, and I am, I, I wish I had the webcam going. Uh, that's on its way here as well. I'd be able to show you guys what exactly I'm doing. I'm hitting up Blueberry Yum Yum with the Tasty Terps oil here. Just opening it up and attaching it to my thing real quick. And then we should be good to go. I wanted to switch over to vaping so I didn't have to take cigarette breaks for A. So that the nicotine one is charging. I have a MyPod or MePod or whatever the fuck they call them. M-I-Pod. And then, um, like I said, I got the Tasty Terps with this Seattle Supersonics themed battery going on here. Looks like it's gonna work. Ooh, it tastes fucking good too. Alright, blueberry yum yum is a go. We'll get good and toasted and play some Fallout 2, boys and girls, and everything in between. Okay, so we're starting a new game. I should have the build saved. Max Chad. Um, yeah, that'll do. I almost don't want small frame. Ah, eh, fuck it. We're gonna go with this build for now. We're gonna cheese Navarro like we always do. Maximus Chatticus, that's right. There are things you must but, uh, know. yeah, Nuke Man, HPZ, I have, uh, Groomish over the there on Twitch. Uh, Dale, good to see ya. Dirge, over there on Twitch. Dirge, I haven't seen you in a while. Uh, salutations. Benjamin Dries here, uh, again as well. I saw Keith in here as well. Sick children. Dark Magician. Good to see all you guys. There is hope, however. A slim hope. That few know of. The old discs speak of an item called the Garden of Eden Creation Kit. It is said it can bring life to the wasteland. This will be your quest, if you prove yourself worthy. For that proof, you must first journey to the Temple of Trials. If you survive, They banned disposable vapes me, over there in the UK? Yeah, I can understand why those are getting banned and stuff. Hands, um, the only reason, uh, like I smoke cigarettes and weed, um, I'd like to switch from cigarettes to vapes, to just vape, but, uh, part of the reason is for when I'm streaming, instead of taking a fucking cigarette break, I can just vape in here, because I don't smoke cigarettes in the house. Okay. Let's fucking go.
Ah, fuck. I'm, I don't know if I'm, I'm, I'm... I doubt I'm gonna fight everything here. In the Temple of Trials. But, uh... We'll at least take out these first two ants. Yes, W, I'm getting there with the <laughs> just smoking weed and not cigarettes situation. I'm getting a little tired, blown out on cigarettes, honestly. Okay. Gonna watch out for the traps here. Also, let's get our quick save going. We actually took a bit of damage going through there. So we'll get past these ants. Damn. There we go. Get fucked. Yeah, miss, miss, miss. Yeah, that's the Temple of Trials for you, Owen. Well, that is classic Fallout in a nutshell. Okay. for that to fucking blow up. Oh, and they got me. Oh, no, I didn't take damage on that. Good. Okay. Fucking two more ants. There we go. That was an easy one. I didn't see what fuck, fuck Tiago said in the chat, so I'm not, I, I can't answer the question that was asked, so I'm, I'm sorry. I could probably scroll it, no, oh wait, let's see. Recently, most Fallout Story videos have been mentioning that too, where did that info come from? What are you guys talking about over here on Twitch? Oh, the Elder's the player's mom? Yeah. Um, it's the, she's the daughter of the original Vault Dweller. There is, uh, it talked about it in the Vault Dweller's memoirs, I think, which came out before Fallout 2, but I'm pretty sure it talks about it in the Fallout 2 game manual as well. But yeah, that is canonical and accurate. Was the Super Sludge the hardest hitting melee weapon in this one? Maybe? I like the cattle prod, but you might that might be the highest damage one, yeah. That sounds right. And we talked uh Cameron out of fighting.
All right, now we got the vault suit, boys. Um. Congratulations, chosen one. Yeah, this is the player's mode. You mom. have survived the Temple of Trials. Are you ready for your quest? Then take this flask. It is from the Holy Vault 13. Vic, a trader in Klamath, brought it to us. He may know where the vault is. You may also need some of what they call money. Here. Find Vic in Klamath. Oh, we will. We are counting on you. We'll find that son of a bitch. Uh, there's stuff that we can loot from her here, too. And then uh, Fergus, who's named after Fergus Urquhart, needs us to fix the well. Fergus Urquhart is uh, the CEO, I'm pretty sure, top guy at uh, Obsidian. Now. Nowadays, not back then. He was just part of Black Owl back then. Uh, we'll grab our shovel. Take more money. from Aunt Morales here, and then uh, we'll do these quests, because I found out the last time we played Fallout 2 that not doing these quests at the beginning kind of disqualifies you from doing them. Greetings, Chosen. Why does the earth before me warm to the touch of your passing? The earth sings with the news of a champion upon the land. Perhaps before you go... Do we know what this playthrough is trying to accomplish, or is it just for fun? I, of Grummish, I am doing a cheese run down to Navarro, and then we're just playing through the game normally after that, uh, hanging out, playing Fallout 2. Uh, I don't typically do challenge runs, though. I'm getting more interested in that type of thing, so... Um, the plants maybe we'll get some of those going. The have infested my garden again. Many seasons have touched my bones, and I am too frail for the fight, which is eternal. In yeah, Tim Kane's YouTube I channel is fantastic. I'm lucky enough to call him a friend uh, nowadays. In my adult years, I've gotten to know uh, him over the past year. Fucking tremendous guy. And uh, his videos probably do increase people looking up uh, Fallout. But then also, like uh, was mentioned, the, the TV show as well. May the gods bless your efforts, Chosen. May your yeah, I know. These plants are going to fuck my day up. Oh. Are we doing okay damage on him? Oh, that was way easier than it should have been. So we'll kill these plants for, uh, I was going to call them Solik, uh, uh, Hakonin. And then we'll, uh, go to Nagor down there. Uh, Nagor is our cousin, and his dog Smoke is, uh, missing. So we'll get that going. I'm going to get this up to 50, just to make life a little bit easier. And we'll, uh, we'll get speech up here. Much uh, cheese strats needed to kill the plants. No, uh, we didn't uh, ah, have to cheese the plants. And also... Okay, so he'll make his uh, healing powder, which I fucking never use. Um... Oh, you've never played Fallout 1 or 2. Uh, I have uh, Grimish. Well, welcome to the stream. Okay, so we'll go find... Uh, smoke. He's over here in the gecko fields. Sometimes the geckos are hostile, sometimes they're not. We'll see what today brings us. It's like they're not attacking us, so that's that's nice. Come on now. Gotta watch out for these green puddles, they'll 
burn your feet. Love the art and music for the classic Fallout games. So now Smoke is with us here. He might hit the puddles. Yeah, I see. And it damages you and you don't want that. I have Grimish over here on Twitch is saying that uh, three New Vegas and four are by far your favorite games besides Dungeons and Dragons. Well, that's pretty dope. Uh, yeah, they are. Oh, the Gecko got hit too. Uh, they are fantastic games. So, good choices. Yeah, the music takes you back. Yeah, me too. All right, so we got that done. Homie down here will teach us a bit about unarmed combat. All right, which uh, raises our unarmed a little bit, which is nice. Hey, soggy dog, good to see you. And we can notice with good perception that this guy has a shiny spear. And uh, Aunt Morales will give us some flint if we fucking put up with her for a second here. And we can sharpen our spear and have a little bit of a better weapon moving forward. Alright, so now we got our flint. Alright, so after giving that to Minoc here, now we have a sharpened spear, which does a little bit more damage. Okay, and we cross the bridge into the Great Wide Open. Our Fallout 1 and 2 is difficult as the modern ones. Uh, they are more difficult than the modern ones, especially if you're not used to playing them. Uh, but that, I don't think that should put you off from playing them. So what we're going to do here is essentially make a beeline to San Francisco, saving along the way. care about those nomads but I will save don't even need to stop in Klamath yet I'm gonna go a bit more over and then yeah just kind of straight down we'll save at this square I don't know if the mashing a trick works in Fallout 2 like it does in the first one if it does, um, I'm going to try it out on encounters today. Hopefully, if we get an Enclave encounter close to Navarro, we can just fucking cheese through it. That'd be really nice. I have 50 Outdoorsmen, which is better than like the 38 that we had before. There's another location. We'll just discover that real quick. That's none of our business. Slavers and Golden Geckos. No thank you. Well, they're making short work of those geckos, too. Excel up! Good to see you! What build we doing? I'm just cheesing Navarro. You fucking know who I am, Excel. Um, energy weapons, big guns build. She's in Navarro, hoping to not die on these random encounters. I think this is the den, yeah. So we'll save here at den. And uh, I'm just gonna fucking head south. I'll save at whatever this is. Yeah, it's nostalgia. I'm I'm right there with you. This is uh, pretty much the first one that I've played as well. Oh, cool. We might not be alive. A Din caravan attacking a Vault City caravan. Alright. 
Looks like they're fighting amongst themselves, actually. What a weird encounter. Free loot? Nah, yeah, it's not worth it. Yeah, they didn't look to be Din Slavers. I don't know what that encounter was about. Last few times we've been playing Classic Fallout, uh, we've gotten weird encounters. And to continue that, last night on uh, the Starfield stream, we got a fucking weird Terramorph encounter on, like, Crete or something. Like, a really early planet. The next encounter that I'm forced into, I'm going to try my cheese trick here. Let's see if this works. It does not. It does not work like it does in Fallout 1, hitting A over and over again. Cannibals and rad scorpions. Mm -mm. Yeah, we definitely need to get that highway, man. Oh shit, there's an encounter map? I didn't know there was an encounter map, actually. I've seen, like, you know, the world map of Fallout 2, but I didn't know that somebody had, like, the chance for encounters. Throwing some Taco Bell, nothing like peeking up. I actually just ate Taco Bell before the stream started. Yeah, right. Learning Gears of War. I'd play some Gears of War. Um... Are you going to post the link in Vault 420? Nice. I don't know about live streaming co-op, but I definitely play some Gears of War. It's been a really long... I haven't played Gears since, like, the first one came out. I don't know if I've played any of the sequels. Oh, fuck. This is not good. Oh, please don't surround me. Luckily, only three of them are really chasing me. So I should always have an out. Fuck. That could have been brutal. Oh, this is even worse. Yeah, we took the wrong... fucking cut through. If we're getting all these mutants, should have went more to the right before I went south. Please don't surround me, you bastards. Next one amigos, yeah, no shit. These are floaters for anybody who's wondering. Oh my god. Next one amigos, dude, who called that? Dick Penisecki. Holy fuck. You called it, brother. Love one amigos, but they will fuck us up. <laughs> Get a lottery ticket. Yeah, there you go. Snez is giving you good advice, Pinaseki. So we're running away from pretty much everything right now, but the tides will turn once we start our cheese run here. 
I think I didn't go far enough uh, east before I fucking went south. But that's okay. We'll be alright. I'd like to save though. We're almost there to the save point. Oh, hey, Horgan encounter. There we go. More like Frank Borgen. Hey, we found him. The only time you'll see a forced child death in uh, Fallout. And they left it in. I'm so glad that Bethesda didn't grandstand about it. It's so important that Frank has these this whole family murdered so that you understand just how fucked up Frank uh, Horgan is and like he's not going to take prisoners about it. So when you see him mow down a whole family, including a child, like, it makes you realize, like, oh, this guy's fucking serious shit, you know? Yep, he has the child killer perk. Right out the gate. I guess I just saved, but I'm gonna do it again. All right, we must be right there. Oh, fire geckos. Good thing we saved. This might be first death of the stream. Fluffy duck, I'm doing well. I hope you're doing well. San Francisco should be right under here. So at least we're fucking there, you know? I still should have went over a couple more squares before I went down. Have a good one, Benjamin. Gotta show us the sergeant before we close this. Yeah, we'll run into Dornan, I'm sure. I usually don't fuck with him, but... Uh, I'll make an exception this stream. That was relatively painless getting down here to San Fran. We'll watch a low low pad and uh, the dragon fight. I love the story behind the Xi and, and uh, San Francisco that we see here because they base their whole culture off, or, off of like old kung fu tapes and movies from that era and uh, it's fantastic. Okay, first part of the cheese here. Give me your money. Oh, I don't think so, bud. I think you're gonna give me your money. Okay. Now we'll see which table he's using. We can get power armor here too, which we will not need at all, so. Good to go. Get his other inventory open, see if he has more money. And he does not. Okay. See ya. We can do the same thing over here. Now, if you have the restoration patch installed, uh, this gets patched out, which is good. But, uh, we're using it. And we're gonna want to get, like, a small arm from him. So we can take Chris out at the Enclave at uh, the gas station, Poseidon Energy. All right, so let's steal the rest of his money. Wait, let me make sure I, that I did in fact save. Okay.
What do you got, good sir? Okay, all of those are too fancy. What's this? How much is that? Damn, HPZ coming in hot with uh, five gifted Mantis memberships. Thank you so much, HPZ. Of course, I uh, I can't see who received them, so make sure to check out the chat to see if you're one of the five that just got gifted a membership on YouTube. Um, thank you, PZ. All right, so let's try to find something a little bit better. Anything says thank you, PZ. Well, good. And hey, there's a super sludge. Somebody was talking about that. Maybe we'll have to go to the other store to get uh, just like a smaller caliber like handgun or something. The mighty pen 15, the mighty penis. Get your hands off my penis. Uh, is uh, a part of that too. Nice. We get skill books from Homeboy over here too, which is kind of handy. Damn, I'm gonna need a gun before I get there. I'd really like it. A meal? A, ch a succulent Chinese meal? Oh, I see you know your judo quite well, sir. Yeah, we've been saying that. Uh, we've been quoting that in like fucking every stream lately. Top tier shit. Dude. How are you going to do this to me? I'll have to spear him. Fuck it. We'll just spear him. Hopefully that works. I'm going to talk to Matt. He'll know what to do. This is Democracy Manifest. <laughs> yeah, man. I'm right there. Alright. What do we got here? Okay, so we accept the quest to get the vertebrate plans. And that's what we're gonna do. That was great timing. I didn't I don't know what it what it, what it lined up with, but good to hear that we had some good timing going. Okay, so now we're going to try not to get a... I'm going to try to get to Navarro without getting fucking smoked. Oh shit! Instantly one-shotted me. Oh my god. F's in the chat. First death of the stream. That's not even what we needed to be worried about. We need to be worried about the Enclave. Thank you for the Fs, everybody, on Twitch and YouTube. You uh, really made the death a little easier. Oh, Juan Amigos, of course. I'm gonna try to duck through that door. You just had to like the stream because uh, it, your like wasn't there anymore? Oh my god. Well, don't forget to like the streams, everybody. Helps the channel out big time. And if you feel like supporting more directly, uh, becoming a member and super chatting and the Streamlabs donations is the best way to do that. And I appreciate you. If you're on Twitch and you want to support, the best way is to go down to the donate tab and just do it through Streamlabs. Who's this? That's a sergeant and a recruit. Hubologists will, like, are not hostile to me, so I'm gonna kinda hide behind them. They will throw grenades, though. I don't wanna get melted. There's quite the fight going on. 
Oh shit, Nuke Man with a fat 10 pound super chat. Just like this. You're leading by a great example there. Uh, Nuke Man, thank you so much. For the 10 great British uh, pounds. I appreciate you so much. Super appreciate it. Alright. I'm hoping to save up here. We are getting so many fucking encounters. But Navarro's only like right there, so we can we can do this. But if we get an enclave encounter, it's fucking instant death. So it's democracy manifest. Ah, oh, fuck. At least I'm pretty far away from him. Gave me a good head start. Oh, he's cut me off. At least only one is following me, though. That's good. See how fast he caught up? Fuck. Okay. Yeah, hopefully democracy manifests itself to not fuck us on these enclave encounters. Oh! Oh no! This is democracy manifest, Jesus Christ. It's over. Ooh, critted me. Get fucked. Don't worry, boys. We will, uh, second death of the stream. There will likely be more because of the fucking Enclave encounter that I know will get at least one. I, though we did do one, uh, one run one time when we didn't hit any Enclave on the way to Navarra. Thank you guys for the Fs, and then uh, Darth uh, Snarf over there on Twitch, thank you. I see everybody. I'm also live on Trovo and Kick, if you're into those kind of things. I just like to, uh, I've been trying to expand my stream platforming. To, to at least Twitch, like Twitch and YouTube, but uh, I have a couple of the other ones going too. Oh, fuck. And the important thing is to like actually make Headway towards the fucking place. Okay. Let's just go one over. Ooh, we got a. Oh, we got Maltese Falcon. Which means we can get a uh, dog meat. So we have dog meat. Okay. So this is a big fourth wall breaking place where it's like they talk about the player and the third person and the first person and Eduardo with a fat ten dollar super chat. Remember the Alamo? Yes, Kyle uh, Katarn, I remember you. What is the most obscure way to find Vault thirteen? Or rather unlock its location. Ah uh, well you can get that fake one uh in NCR from that guy selling maps to it. I guess that doesn't really unlock it. Um Does that lead to unlocking it? If so, that that way, in my opinion. But I always end up just uh, finding out about it through Vault 15. I think it's Vault 15. Where you cross-reference everything. But thank you so much, Eduardo. I, I love you. I appreciate you. So that was the Cafe of Broken Dreams at the Maltese Falcon. We are almost... Is 13 still just west of- yes, so it is, uh, it's in the exact same location that it was in the first Fallout. But, um, you can't discover it, you can't go to it until you've heard about it. Or, like, you know, learn its location through the game. Should make a video about the various ways to unlock its location, actually. I'd totally space that there's more than one. Oh, looks like we instantly got an enclave. 
It kind of, okay, so that's okay, because we're so fucking close. We're so close. But I told you, Enclave is like instant death. Instant fucking death. So. I uh, load the game. We saved right before it happened. Oh, Darf, Darf Snarf uh, came over to YouTube. I see. Oh my god, it's not even gonna let us, like, fucking move. Oh, that's interesting. Come on, Dogmeat. Oh, Dogmeat's going for it. Oh! Dogmeat about to tank this encounter. Yeah. Don't worry, we'll be killed too, don't it's... If we don't die here, I was gonna say, if we don't die here, I'd be amazed. Yeah, Tiago, uh, Dogmeat was serious about critting the Enclave. He wasn't fucking around. Um, my big thing is, no matter where we move on the world map, it's giving us that encounter. I wonder if I can... Oh! I tried to trick it. It did move us a different direction, though. We will be uh, killed, though. So... Might as well just load. Ugh. Well, now the game's hanging. Come on. Sorry that this is uh, giving us such a hang up here. Okay, let's try down, over. Oh, fuck you. So, what I'm going to try to do is, uh, get to even moving, like, a pixel or two. Saving again and kind of trying to restart the encounter here. So I'm hoping... Oh, we got so much closer. Look at that. We got this, boys. Oh, we got real close that time, too. The Wasteland has claimed your life. Arroyo attempts to send out others to search for the Gek, but they die quickly, and the village soon follows. Good. We'll get it. This is the time, boys. You just gotta believe. We're in the same map square. Thank you for the F, uh, Fraggle. I appreciate you. Alright. Come on. Oh, it instantly gave us a file. Oh, come on. Fallout 2. Be nice to me. Oh, no. Hey, we get to see a bunch of uh, neat death animations, though. Look at Dogmeat still going. Okay. I have faith, guys. This is going to be the one. Whoops. Let's try that. Hey, your boy. Okay. Okay, don't tell them that we're looking for Navarro. But, uh, yeah, now we gotta just sharpen spear him to death. Oh, that's not gonna work. Don't throw it. Come on, dogmeat. You're my help here. Yeah! Fuck him up. Fuck him up. 
Dog meat is helping big time. Oh yeah, then he's gonna run. I'll throw it now. Missed. Fuck. Get him, dog meat. Yes. Get him, dog meat. Thank God. Got our spear back. And then we still have to make it out of the fucking map area of Navarro. Because uh, they'll be hostile regardless if we have the fucking APA or not. Yeah, downright spiffy, you're right about that. And Patty, you're also right about dying in fall. I've never died in a follow game, though. I don't know what you're talking about. Whoa! I bet you it's because of dog meat. I bet you it's because of dog meat. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. That should not be happening. That should not be happening. Okay. And now he's... Okay, that's sad. I'll fucking come back for you. That has to be happening because of him. Owen says it's because of dog meat. Okay. I was gonna say that shouldn't be happening. So. That's alright. We'll pick him back up. Yeah, he's sad now. That made me sad too. It was like, oh, fuck. Okay, so they shouldn't be hostile. And if they are, uh, my heart's going to be broken. Okay, perfect. And we'll have to come back down here for the key fob. Let's not grab anything crazy yet. So I want that space for the APA. We can grab that as some kind of gun to defend ourselves. On the way back to San Francisco. Oh, she blows. Bam. Second best armor in the game. Okay. Also gives us a strength boost, which is nice. Yeah, fuck it, I'll take those too. But there's that uh, gun over here. Take that too. So that'll protect us the best it can. We'll still get pretty much immediately killed in an Enclave encounter. But uh, we'll be coming back to Navarro, so anybody who wants to see Dornan and all that other kind of stuff, that'll be later. Pretty much from here, we go back up to Klamath and just play the game as if we never went down to Navarra. Okay. We got him, boys. Okay, now we just don't die on the way back to Klamath. Oh, not Klamath, we need to go to, uh, fuck. Though we do have a little bit of armor, so we might be able to do this. Dogmeat will probably rush and then get fucking killed, though. So I'd like Dogmeat to not be murdered, but, uh... Ugh. We could have got canine as well. But we can do that later. But then we'd have just like two dogs chilling. Hmm. I'll wait. Okay, let's take this a little more seriously here.
The goal will be to make it back to Cafe of Broken Dreams and then down to San Fran and then back up to Klamath. Let's fucking try it. Roll the dice. Ah! Putting distance between us and Navarro is definitely the right move. Dog bless. Yeah, I agree, Soggy. I agree. Alright, see, we're a little closer. Oh, you dicks. Yeah, and then they're talking shit about the water chip up there. I'll try to run past them. That's not gonna work. I don't stand a chance trying to actually fight them. Right now. So we will get our revenge on these assholes, don't you worry. Wow, really? Fucking come on. Okay. Oh, instantly got a fucking encounter. Hey, there's only three of them. Dog me just does not give a shit. Tell the dog to flee in combat. William, that's a good idea. Well, because the, the way I look at these encounters is instant death anyway, so... We're just gonna get a square away each time. Night Gabriel, welcome. Thank you for uh, joining us here on the stream. Okay. Fuck off. No, I don't want to encounter an Enclave Patrol. Thank you. It won't give me a choice now. Oh, it did give me a choice. Fuck yeah. Oh, yes. Back at Cafe Broken Dreams. The joy of reloading Fallout 2. Yeah, you get it, Andrich. You know what's going on. All right. We might be out of the clear. Mm. Okay, so we are not in the clear yet. Let's go down one. You bitch. Come on. Now I suppose you're going to tell me you're just out looking for the water chip? Fuck you, Enclave. Oh, I'm gonna kill those fuckers. Give me like two hours and those fuckers are done. We'll hunt them for, uh, sport. Okay, we're pretty far out from Navarro. And anything else isn't going to give us that big of a problem. Like I said, I could have recruited a canine. Oh, fuck, these will give us problems, though. Um, if Dogmeat falls in combat, like, that's on him at this point. He's fucking that gecko up there. I'll try to get out before they kill him. How often the game rolls random encounters? It depends on, um... Your outdoorsman skill, I'm pretty sure. But no, I, I don't know the math behind the games. I'm not a big math dude. Oh, uh, yeah, no. Dog meat's gonna be toast. There he goes. F's in the chat for dog meat, because I'm gonna try to get out of here. Okay, dog meat has been cooked. Rest in peace. 
We'll get K9 uh, later on in the playthrough, so we'll, we will have a dog again. I don't know if he responds at the Cafe of Broken Dreams if, like, you get the encounter again. Because I know you can get the encounter multiple times, but I don't think he responds. Bruno, yeah, it's sad, but we'll be okay. We'll have another dog in the stream. Dog meat's just kind of a Easter egg in this one. Yeah, well, somebody said in the chat that I could have made him flee during combat, but... Fuck him. Uh, William, no, these aren't really aliens. What's cool about these aliens is, uh... Like, the Chosen One knows them as aliens, because that's the only thing the Wasteland knows them as, but they're really Wanamingos from, like, mines uh, and caves and stuff around the area. And then once you learn that, uh... in running and stuff, uh... They become Wanamingos instead of being called aliens. Except I do think some of the ones in the encounters still remain aliens, like uh, in name. But I just always thought that was a neat little feature. Fucking death claws, really? Come on, man. We're almost to San Fran again. Okay, this is none of our concern. Pretty soon we'll have our pulse rifle and uh, a fancy, some, some levels that'll tide us over. And we won't have to run from every encounter. Wanna make ghost sounds Australian? Well, there you go. Uh, Felix, I really enjoy uh, the classic Fallout games, but I've been playing them since they came out when I was like 11 years old in the 90s. Uh, I enjoy them a lot. I think they're worth your time for sure. Oh, I don't need any of the loot from them. That is a good strategy, though. You let them fight and then loot the losers. Um, I don't need any of their loot. It would just weigh me down at this point. All right. Talk to the Brotherhood again. Oh, fucking Christ. Do any of you veterans out there know what I did wrong here? This is why you have multiple saves, boys. Fuck. I have to go back to Navarro. I didn't grab the vertebrate plants. Which is literally like the whole fucking reason of going up there. What a stupid rookie fucking mistake that was. Had I gone up there to get the canine stuff, I would have probably remembered to grab the fucking vertebrate plants. Yeah, I should always make a hard save at Navarro. God, I can't believe I did that. That means we're going to have to go through all of those Enclave encounters again. I could probably fight these things, actually. Let's see. Though they are mean centaurs instead of just normal ones. But I'd love to dump some, <laughs> some skill points into my fucking outdoorsman. Honestly, I'm missing all over the place, son of a bitch. Why am I missing so much? Oh! I thought I'd be able to fight him. 
I'm just getting my fucking ass kicked. Hey, Fluffy Duck, uh, that's good to hear. Look at how fast those fucking geckos are. Oh, Jesus Christ. Of course I'll miss. God damn it. You did not miss Sergeant Dornan. No. We, we were going to go back for Dornan. Fuck me. And I, now I have to go back for the vertebrate plants because I wasn't fucking paying attention. Use cafes of broken dreams as a camp. Yeah, dog meat's not there anyway. You know we're just going to get swarmed with these fucking Enclave encounters, too. Whatever, I deserve it. Oh, nice. I deserve it for not fucking doing what I needed to be doing. Which is already going to be a pain in the ass anyway, when it comes to uh, getting these plans. It always is. I'm going to try to just outrun this. Whoa! 64 hit points. Christ. It was literally twice my HP. Cool, man. Alright. Round two. Round fucking 15. Yep, of course. Yeah, there's no way. Yeah, sorry that we have to go through all this shit again, guys. I mean, everybody seems to be enjoying it, and then people are having a good time. But, uh... I just made you sit through all this shit, and now we have to do it again. I'm just gonna move pixels, like, pretty much, like, just a few pixels at a time. Fuck. They're missing, which is really nice. Oh, come on. Oh, cool, we were out of their range. Ooh, nice. Can I save? Save right here, please. Good. Hey, we did save back there, though, so we'll just open up in battle, I guess. Might have fucked myself on that one. Okay. We'll start a two save system at least. Alternating back and forth after this. Oh, we're so close. Nice. Fuck. Hey, what's in here?
Nothing, huh? It's fucked up. Oh my god, Nuke Man's running low on his dog theme antics. So all good things must come to an end, Nuke Man. Hey, any of the veterans uh, of Fallout 2 in the chat, explain to me what the fuck I'm doing wrong here, because this always happens. I've gotten this to work, like, the first few times, but I go down to talk to the cook. Right? And he tells me about the beef between the two dudes up there. What's going on in maintenance? Raul, the vertebrae mechanic, doesn't like Quincy. Head of maintenance. Two hours getting into it. Okay. Yeah, I hear you. Okay. So, that means I should be able to go tell them, like, oh, hey, he's talking shit, and then I can, like, sneak it, right? This is not the restoration patch. No. Let's save. Okay, he won't talk to me right now. No, it's not the same Raul. You need to talk to the first guy on the left and then again to the guy on the right. Well, let's see. Let's go talk to the other one. If it doesn't work, I'm just gonna do what I've been doing. Okay, he won't talk. Hey George, thank you for the kind words, big time. I appreciate you. That's so how we're gonna do this. This is a real big pain in the ass to do, by the way. So, um. Okay. Wait, 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 Okay. buff out right here. Take the buff out. Okay. Perfect. Okay, I'm gonna save because I'm gonna try to take that stuff back. We have the vertebrate plants, so okay. Okay. 
I don't think he gets pissy about fucking with anything else. Definitely take awareness. Okay. I'm increasing outdoorsman because I'm tired. I'm just tired. 69% it is. I don't even give a fuck. And we got our electronic lockpick. It was something that we didn't have and during the last turn. I was like, oh, fuck. Hey, combat armor. And we can get the canine motivator. Read the book? Uh, yeah, that's a good idea. Read both of them, actually. I no longer have the big book. Oh, there it is. Nothing. Ooh. Don't think we need that other shit. This is the locker that we want, though. Oh, no, it isn't. This one is. With the canine motivator. Alright. I have to read some of these books. Oh, this can fuck off. So can this. Um, and the super sledge for sure. Actually carrying around a whole lot of shit that I don't normally carry around. Even gonna be able to do this because I'm in this big ass bulky armor. The problem is if uh, the reason I keep reloading is um, if I do it after he, if I do it again after he tells me not to, I'm pretty sure it causes a fucking problem. I'm just trying to get. Hey, there we go. This uh, canine motivator, so we can get canine. Robo dog. Come on now. No? You fucking. Okay, I really don't need all those explosives and everything either. So let's. Do this. I don't need these grenades. I'm gonna keep one of those just in case. Don't need the combat shoddy at all. Alright. We're fucking out of here, boys. We'll get our dog and leave. Or when we come back, um, you know what? Let's see. Can't rest here, shit. I can, uh, go piss Dornan off. Isn't this him? Where is he? Does anybody know uh, where Dornan is?
might want to rest until morning if we can. Yeah, we're at Navarra, uh, Jedi. Uh, I just forget, because I never go talk to him. He's doing his rounds. The gate guard. Okay, hold up. Let's see if that's... Hey, John Hookum, thank you very much for checking it out. Uh, yeah, Tim's become one of my friends, and it's been really amazing to get to, like, know him. And, uh, that was a truly amazing opportunity. He should be in his barracks or wandering the base. Okay. I know that not having your power armor on is the way to go. I'm gonna try to talk to this gate guard without the power armor. Instantly aggro, as you should be. What the hell happened to my agility there? That was a little rough. Maybe it's because I was over encumbered. Hey, Layla, good to see you. They will kill you, power armor or not? Is that true, Owen? I thought they weren't aggro. Oh. Interesting. Well then where the hell is... Welcome to Camp there he is. So you're the replacement. What's your name, Private? What was that? Did you forget something, maggot? I am not his sir! I work for a living, you moron! You will call me Sergeant, or Sergeant Dornan! Do you understand me? Outstanding. Proceed on the double to the hangar, where you will stand guard duty! You will do a fine job! Do you understand? You moron! You are not to question my orders! When I say jump, you jump! When I say fight, you fight! When I tell you to die for your country, then you will certainly die! Have I made myself clear? All right. No, uh, he's got us on duty, but I'm fucking leaving. I'll just load to uh, do this as well. Get the other dialogue from him. Welcome to Camp Navarro. A civilian? How in the hell did a civilian get on this base? I'll have someone to ask for dinner. Get the civilian off government property. Oh, that actually helped. Not really, though, because I want to get uh, K9. Alright, anyway, so there's some of the dialogue. Hey, Cthulhu, good to see you. Artemis, good to see you, too. Perfect. Okay. Dude, get this shit up even more. 80. Looks good. Now we'll get energy weapons up. Okay. Just keep trying until it works. There we go. So now... I'm not sure what the blue pass key's for, actually, now that I think about it. Oh, 
Um, no, I, it is not Dornin that you end up calling uh, on the gecko thing. That, that's a different enclave soldier. But uh, you do end up calling the enclave uh, if you want to. It's optional. Didn't mean to come up here. Uh, if you fuck around with the gecko power plant, you can get a hold of them. We're not going to rescue the Deathclaw right now because I'm pretty sure that'll aggro fucking everybody. And we will return to Navarra. Because we'll have to get the key fob and all that other kind of shit, so. Though I could just get the key fob now. Nah, we'll worry about it later. Dick Pinaseki with a fat $5.45. Man, that Sergeant Dornan is a real, uh, is a real, uh, what's the word? Uh, reminds me of Norm MacDonald. Uh, that guy's a real, uh, jerk. It doesn't aggro anybody when you save him? Alright, pro tip, let's see. Because I figured this guard would be pissed off. Are you sure about this, Proto? Yeah. We can't. Yeah, it won't, uh... It's not giving me any, uh, options to say I'm gonna kill it. Uh, well, we'll save him when we fucking come out of... Uh... When we're back down in Navarro, fucking shit up. Talk to the doc before? Well, he's dead, unless you're talking about one of these. I don't really care, we'll save him later. You can go by a secret door. Oh yeah, that is true, because there's an exit. Where the fuck? I wonder where that's from. It, it doesn't matter, guys. It's not that big. Oh, yeah, the secret doors are here. Okay. Usually save the death club before killing the scientists. I see. Um, I have an electronic lockpick. See if this will work. Oh, it's not gonna let me do it. I need a passkey. Well, again, we are gonna storm this base later on. And we'll. Oh, the blue card? Really? Oh, fuck. That's what the blue card's used for. Well, he just assumes that he's saved, then. Zarn. Okay, well, level up. Your energy webs up here. Then we never see Zarn again, because he probably fucking killed himself. Shut down the power too? What the fuck are you talking about? In here? Oh, you mean this thing? I'm not quite sure what you're talking about. 
Because I'm, like I said, I plan on coming back to Navarro in game and doing all that shit, so. But Reva, click the generator. Are you talking about this? Or are you talking about, like, this thing? We'll be fine, boys. We'll we'll be back. Our biggest focus needs to be getting the fuck out of here without losing the dog to Enclave patrols. I got better outdoorsman now. Almost 100%. Didn't matter. Okay, we're going to try to fuck off. Come on, Kanan. Yes. Why are you shooting my dog? Are you serious? And the game is hung up. Cute. This happens in combat sometimes. And other things. Dead. Fuck it. What is outdoorsman? We're at 80% outdoorsman. It couldn't give me a fucking... Do you want to encounter this? Also, let me... Uh, this. Do that. I need to... Put up a bunch of this shit. So I have... That link. Oh, I see what uh, Excel posted for the map that they were talking about in uh, the Discord server. So I appreciate that. I'm just getting all of my things back on top here. Looking good. Okay. Yeah, George, I would love to see uh, some of these classic Fallout games really get a good remake treatment. Come on with this. I can't fucking wait to be out of the Enclave area. This is, it's so, like, this is the worst part about cheesing the fucking armor. Because it's like, I have, I was going to say, I have fucking 80% outdoorsman. Like, please give me the option. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, though, George. Like, uh... I think the classic Fallout games really stand out. Yeah, Enclave Troopers are instant death. That's why I said, Dark Magician, uh, give me an hour or so. We'll come back here and we're going to fucking show them what for. I can tell you that much. Okay. Back down to Cafe of Broken Dreams. We actually have the vertebrate plans, right? So we can sure. Okay. Waste of our fucking time. I sound sick. Uh, I was sick before, but uh, I didn't think I sounded sick now, so that's troubling. But I am feeling much better than I did a couple weeks ago, where I had the flu like all fucking week. It was not. It was not tasty. Don't be an Enclave Patrol. Ugh, it's almost just as fucking bad. The double turns that these geckos get are really fucking neat sometimes. Hey, Austin Lee, thank you for joining the stream. I hope you're doing well. I should be able to actually hit them now. That is true. Let's see what my chances are. Don't I have fast shot? That's interesting. It let me aim before. Weird. 25 hit points is not bad. 
I don't know how many they have. I'll have to look at because I have awareness, so I should be able to see. Only thirty-one left. Got one. Get fucked. Canine doing work. There we go. Hit me with that fire. PK fire. There we go. Get fucked. I sound okay. Thank you, Fluffy. And once we get the pulse rifle, shit gets serious. Wanamingos. These guys are usually tough too. How many HPs do you have? 160. I'm not even gonna fucking try it. They get too close, I'll shoot them. Oh, they resist energy too? Yeah, fuck that. When we have the Bozar, we'll be alright. But... Their weakness is fire. Well, we'll use that then. It's my weakness too. If somebody set me on fire, I'd be pretty uh, upset. IRL. Oh, my weakness being set ablaze. Okay, we made it, boys. Christ, what the fuck is going on here? The press gang, huh? Nice. Love it. Beautiful. Love to see it. Hubologists are taking care of business. I don't trust that. I don't want to accidentally hit a hubologist. Good to see you. Okay. Let's come in during the day. Go talk to Matt. Because I actually have his shit now. Hey, well, Austin, thank you for stopping by the stream. Oh, shit, my bad. VRD, baby. Oh, look at all those levels. Um, all right, let's get speech up. We're really going to need lockpick to be 
Good. So let's get it to there. Energy weapons. Over 100, please. And we're going to want big guns to start to be looking good, too. Nice. Nice. Now we're talking. Open the fucking door. Is there a max level in the classic Fallout? Uh, I think you stop getting perks after 25. Am I wrong, boys? But you can continue to level up. Oh, 24 for Fallout 1, 50 for Fallout 2. There you go. Owen knows his shit. Uh, it's always good to have somebody that also knows the games uh, in the chats because sometimes my stoned ass forgets fucking everything. So, pulse rifle, thank you very much. Don't need this anymore. Give me all of this. Soon we'll have the car. And uh, you can also use the pulse pistol, but we're good. But soon we'll have the car. We won't have to worry about you know all this other shit. I'm gonna go ahead and just store that crowbar. We'll plant the implant. Okay, and we got power armor and fucking brotherhood armor if you need that, but we don't. Put on our charisma chip here because that's the one we found. Wait, am I radiated? Oh my god, I am. Where the fuck did that come from? Interesting. Passively walking through the map. Oh, the geckos. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. Oh, maybe just something that was attacking me. Because typically, there's I can't think of really many places in Fallout 2 that'll give you radiation. We'll steal more of his shit. We're not really doing the quests yet. Uh, here. We'll be coming back for them. Rads are definitely more common in the later Fallout games, 100%. The only location that I can think of that gives them to you in the first one is the Glow. And I can't think of any that give them to you in Fallout 2, any location at all. Getting our Bozar ammo ready. I don't even know if we have that much. That many, uh, no, we don't have that much gold. Um, so I won't be able to do that right off the bat. Let's um, put this back for now. Because we can just steal the money back. Oops. Oh, I can't carry that much. Cute. So just some stim packs and a fuck and some bullets. Yeah, I'm excited to have the car.
Seeing if he has any gold on this table just to be safe. Okay. Definitely want to sell that uh, other plasma gun that we have too. Nuke man, you have a good rest of your day, man. Thanks for stopping by. Yeah, you speed run, uh, dark magician, to uh, get the car. That's not a bad idea, and it's something I probably should have done. But we good. Well, he has a Vindicator. Oh, that's a Gatling laser. My bad. I think he does have a Vindicator, though. Guess it has a 1900. We need to make sure we buy Super Stims, too. Forgot about that. So we should go back over to Homie. Because we'll need super students when we actually get to the oil rig. I don't know. Okay, none on that table. What's my favorite wasteland to traverse? Um, the Commonwealth is pretty good. Uh, the Mojave and the Commonwealth, I, I think, are up there. Probably, yeah, I don't know, it's just there's so much stuff hidden in the, like, hidden around in the Commonwealth, and, uh, it's built up, well, you know what, uh, Fallout 76 with, uh, Appalachia's Wasteland, uh, that map is really good, in my opinion. Bro, you're supposed to have super stims. I swear to God, he's supposed to have super stims. I don't know if the bald guy does or not. Why do I need super stims to heal during the boss fight? No, I use them to kill President Richardson. Well, hey, Owen, uh, enjoy your snack and dishwasher. I appreciate you being in the stream. No, because he only sells weaponry, so he's not going to have super stims. Uh, we'll find some as we go. Uh, well, 76 is a game I definitely have my problems with, but its world map is really good. I really hope we don't forget the fucking Super Sims. Chosen. I know. Okay, so... Let's get a little out here, and then, uh... What is that to Klamath? What state would I want uh, Fallout to take place in? Fallout 5 to take place in. Uh, I've always wanted a, like, New Orleans Fallout. I think that would be a really good one. I know that's not a state, that's a city, but, like, that area would be really good for, like, a spinoff akin to, like, New Vegas. I feel like Fallout 5 is going to be somewhere more centralized as a, you know, city, New York, um, a, a big East Coast city like that is more than likely where they'd go with it. Um, so we'll see, you know, but I'd love to see, uh, Miami would be a good choice too, Hawaii would be a fucking fantastic choice. Damn it. Don't 
Don't you kill my dog. You bastard. There we go. Nice. What? Can I not hit him? 8%. Let's go. And I did get him. Get fucked. Oh yeah, Chicago. Yeah, yeah we did uh, see Chicago in Tactics. Tactics is fun. And it's uh, one people have been requesting a lot for a stream, so... Probably gonna stream that one soon. Oh, you dick. He killed K9! That's to the chats, boys. I can't believe this. Yeah, I hope I did die. Good. Okay, we died too, so... Uh, F's not necessary. Well, I guess if you want to F for that. Yeah, those, uh... Fire geckos do not play. Thank you for the apps, everybody. More fire geckos, huh? Well, not on my watch. <laughs> Don't get killed, K9. God damn it. So we're working our way up to Klamath here, if you're wondering what's going down. I'm trying to figure out how to get my fucking vape thing to work. 
but it's not turning on. It's like it's fucking not working or something. Oh, that's fucking lame. Uh, I don't know why it's doing this. I would not like to encounter some cannibals. Uh, what do we got there? B B two eleven. Good to see you. I don't know what the fuck the problem with this thing is. The vape that I got. Why are we aggro to a Din Caravan? Uh, Hermes Mora, good to see you. I don't know what their fucking problem is. Oh, it's slavers. thing. Let's see if this one wants to work. It's the same kind of deal here. Is maybe just this uh, little thing is not working right? Okay. It might be the little fucking cartridge thing. Not working correctly. One second, boys. Okay, they're running away. I don't really care. Um, I thought this came with... Up. I thought it came with two of these little fucking. I wonder. One second, guys. I'm uh, checking shit out here. Dude, it's definitely. Whatever the fuck this thing's problem is. Okay. So I wonder then. One second, guys. I wonder if this one works with this one, even though it wasn't working with everything else. No. Okay. This is so weird. I'm going to have to go to, back to the fucking store and uh, handle this at some point. Christ. All right. Well, sorry about the holdup, guys. Okay. Yeah, New Orleans would be good. Oh my god, with uh, Adam with 550 uh, Turkish dollars here. Good evening to you, Adam. Uh, thank you for stopping by the stream, and thank you for your generosity. Sorry for the delay there. I was trying to figure out my uh, nicotine vape thing. And it is not being dope right now, so... Pretty sure I'm going to have to go back to the store to figure that out.
Okay, we can get the Bozar like pretty much right now too. We'll guard the Brahmin for Tor. And we could take out the Dutton brothers right here if we wanted to. They're kind of behind this. But, uh, it's not that big of a deal. Did this uh, stream stop for anybody? Uh, well, I sure hope the stream didn't stop for you. It shouldn't have. Got him. Got him. And the screen flashes because the fucking brothers get out of here. Yeah, you'll understand uh, Tor perfectly if uh, you have low intelligence as well. You guys have like a full blown crazy good conversation. Okay, see, so there's a rad scorpion claws here that they've been using to be dicks with. I think we can get jerky from here. I'll take it. Me too. This is perfect. Go ahead and put that there. I'll take the new Coca Cola. I'll leave those. Yeah, those little secrets are fucking top tier, Dark Magician. Let's get a... Uh... Yeah, we'll do the whiskey still here. We couldn't convince him to pay us more, that's fine. Alright. So, we'll go refill his still here. Which gives us free reign to merc these geckos. That was my bad for being way too far out. taking care of these geckos here while we get to whiskey bob still come on you big golden fucker let's go Got him. Nice one, K9. K9. 
Okay. I think we did pretty good. There's probably still some scragglers walking around, yeah. Pick up the wood. So he'll tell us about stuff going on in town now. There's a couple of things here. Okay. All right. I know that we can go rescue Smiley. Oh fuck, I wonder what our repair is. Forty-six. Fuck. So what we did right there is grab these boots because they're going to protect us from the nonsense. I don't really need the rat axe either. And I should have had K9 just wait. When K9 gets back over here, I'll have him just wait. Okay. Okay, just uh, let him wait there so he doesn't have to deal with all that shit. Oh, the boogeyman's hidden uh, Fallout 3 for selling children to the fucking slavers. Oops.
Oh my god. Fuck. Come on. Well, let's go, big guy. got all of them here. Some more over in this direction. Beautiful. Do I like Cyberpunk? Ruds, I've been really enjoying Cyberpunk lately. I liked it when it launched as well. Like, uh, I had it on PC, so there wasn't as many bugs as some, uh, some other people were experiencing. But, um... I'm really thinking about taking another BRD. But I've been enjoying it. Pack Rack, it is. Uh, I've been enjoying it since its major updates, big time. I haven't checked out Phantom Liberty, but I'm excited to. All right. Okay, so we'll get him back to Klamath. And just to be safe, guys, I'm going to... Uh, put this fucking vape thing in just to make sure um, So I'm wondering if I should have my little pod in it while I'm trying to fucking charge it okay. I'm gonna charge this thing and then we'll uh, Or I'm gonna plug it in because it sounds like I'm gonna have to go back to the fucking store and deal with it So one second guys I have it plugged in over there and the light is on like it's charging, so we'll fucking see what's going on. Sorry about the hiccups with that, but yeah, it'll allow me to... No, it's not a screw on, uh... The, the, the one I have for... Ah, shit, just dropped it. The one I have for... Uh, THC is a screw on one, but uh... I have one of those my pods, me pods or whatever. For nicotine. And it's just, it's being weird. It's being funky. But it's acting like it's charging now. We'll see what happens. Alright, so Smiley's on his way back to fucking Klamath. And we'll get a mutated toe because we'll be walking through all this shit. I'm hoping that uh, with my under 50% repair, I'll be able to repair this fucking generator. It is just a dice roll, so. Green goo's never good. Yeah, watch out. Alright, let's hope we can fucking do this. Oh, I repaired the generator and started up. Look at me. Boom. Alright, excellent. That went way easier than expected. 
so we'll have the Bozar soon. I should wear my fry cook boots. Uh, they melted. We had them before, but they have melted. Close the gap. Dead. I don't think, yeah, we can't loot him. Isn't there, is there an implant here? I thought I've, for some reason, it, my brain is telling me there is. Take these. Why is the Bozar so underpowered in New Vegas? I'm not sure. It's super fucking OP in Fallout 2, though. Don't need that, really. Alright, she blows. Yeah, it's still acting like it's charging. Maybe it was just dead and I was charging it wrong. I don't know. I do not know, boys. Okay, so now we have the Bozar. Though I do like to keep that like super offhand just in case we need to put our weapons away. Hell yeah. Okay, off we go. Pick our dog up and... Get to getting. This will also get a Sulik for free. We and I thank you. Name Sulik. How can we repay? We and I know many things. Travel from great salt water to home of biting lizards. Okay. We're there. Grampy Bone say we might find sis with you. Not just Grampy Bone, all tribe spirits. Grampy Bone just wiser and stronger than the rest. Let's ease on down. Okay. What you be needing? What this stuff we be like ugly on you? <laughs> nice, Solik. Nice. It's a fucking funny, Solik. Wait, uh, where's the crash for Dizzy Whitman's crash for bird? I believe is up here. Wrecked. Whoops. But this is, I always pointed out, this is the vertebrate that, uh, Daisy Whitman talks about crashing over Klamath in New Vegas. Okay, we'll do the rat quest here. Are there any axes in Fallout? Uh, in the newer ones, there are. I'm, I don't remember. I don't think there are are in one or two there might be one in tactics
All right, buddy. Oh, yeah, shit. He gave us the key, but lockpick it for the XP. Those protonic axes in a uh, old world old world blues are some of my favorite fucking weapons of all time. I'm trying to get everybody up here, so I don't have to waste my ammo on my dog is playing with his bed. I waste my fucking ammo on these rats. Those protonic axes in the inversal versions of them. Oh my god. So good. <laughs> Spatch do no TV and no beer make Homer something something. Go crazy? Don't mind if I do. So look. these rats. Nice. Okay, King Rat's right here. Dead.
coming around this way. Yeah, we killed that king rat, don't you worry. Hey, Connor Murphy. Thank you for stopping by the stream. I'm uh, glad you have caught the live stream. I'm very happy to have you. Okay. Come on, get the fuck up there. And also, take that shit back out. At least there's bigger rats up here. Toast. Okay. I forget what's down here. Take it. Is Sulik Jamaican? No. I don't think so. He just has that uh, tribal twang of the area. I understand, like, uh, his, inf his cadence and inflection it does sound like he's from that neck of the woods, but I don't think he needs just a tribal from this area. Thank you for closing the gap. Goris is your favorite companion Jedi? Yeah, I like Goris. I'm not a big fan of the talking death claws, but I do like Goris. Yeah. Right. Oh shit, I thought that thing was dead, or I would have shot it. Now we can take that off. Go over here. What do you fucking mean? What do you mean that does nothing? Thank you. Also, there's an old con trick on this part of the map that I'll show you guys. So we got that part. All right, good. And because of the way the tracking works on uh, Fallout 2, we can just click on the other side of the fence and fucking get over there. Yeah, you're meant to blow it up. Yeah. Lazarus, I, I, I know, but we, we got through it. All I'm doing in Klamath, fucking see you later. Oh, Smiley will teach us how to skin geckos. Alright. Everybody get out of the way of the door. To the den we go. Golden Gex, huh? Let's fucking go. Hmm. 
miss. Still one out there, fuck that. And GG. And we could loot their skins if we wanted to, but yeah, it's fine. for the thieving ass kids. Let's see if they actually got anything left me. Nuka Cola? He might have taken that Nuka Cola from me. Get my shit back. Oh, I got caught stealing the Nuka Cola. Fuck you. Talk to Fred for her. He needs to get the fuck out of the way. Okay, we'll help him out. Yeah, oh shit, it's them boys. Sure was. It sure was, Soggy Doggy. Been a while since you've played Fallout 2 Burning One? Uh, well, you should change that, because it is fantastic. Okay. I'll go get her book. Bum Fungus, good to see ya. today. Yeah, burning, uh, burning one, you can beat the first fallout in an afternoon, like you said. Yeah, that's very true. Okay, she shouldn't have any more work for us. So right now we're heading to the church on the next map here so that we can check the chemicals inside. Oh, 
Alright, so she wants me to ask Metzger, the leader of the Slavers Guild here, uh, if she can fuck up Tyler for their spot to guard this thing. The difficulty spike is a little, is brutal burning. Yeah, no, it can be. FO2 is cool, Fluffy Duck. You are right about that. Hey, I was just talking about trying to fandangle buying a new Cadillac myself, uh, Connor. Because my uh, credit's gotten very good in my adult years. And I'm thinking about using that to finance a Cadillac. Sounds nice on paper. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> Okay, so now we check with Tyler about a possible weakness. Uh, Connor, I don't know shit about cars, so if you're asking me any more specifics beyond, you know, like, would it, you know, I was looking at Cadillac, I was thinking of Cadillacs. I want something new, like 2020 or newer. Uh, I know that. But I know dick about cars. Well, this should be easy since you're practically bulletproof. That's what I'm saying, Burning Man. You go down and you fucking cheese Navarro and you get your goddamn armor. And the sky's the limit. I'd like to be in here by the time the fight starts. Currently, right now, I have a uh, Ford Edge, like a little SUV thing. Alright. This house is clear. Thank you. Lara. We'll go harass the ghost of Anna Winslow real quick. Oh, we're getting that choppy nonsense that happens every once in a while with these games. I feel like it's a memory leak in the game. Come on. Okay. We'll talk to mom. Yeah, we're getting the lag central right now. Okay. 
Okay, so we're going to... You've never had that issue in Fallout 1 only in Fallout 2. It, uh, that's fair. It definitely happens more in Fallout 2, Burning 1. Um... Fuck, I'll give him a thousand. Ha ha ha. Okay, so he'll pass out. We'll deal with him when it's time. Okay, so she just gave us information about people that have been around that haunted house. And now we also can deliver a meal to Smitty. Do we have any favorite 80s action movies that you can check out? I, uh... I'm not a big movie person myself, so I wouldn't know much. Hey, right, somebody brought up Robocop. That's a good one. Big Trouble in Little China is a good one. Ah, uh, the chat has this. So... My opinions are not needed. So we scare Joey. Into giving us the locket that he stole from the house. We give it back to Anna. She drops her bones. We bury the bones. Bada bing, bada boom. Predator is good. Uh, dude, I love those old uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle movies as well. Dude, they're fucking great. This house is clear. those bones. Wow. The fuck is going on here? This is her grave here. Use the shovel on it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, motherfucker, look. Come here. Oh, there's somebody there. those big guns up. Okay, let's deliver that meal to Schmitty. What is their favorite thriller slash crime movie? Who's? Mine? Uh, I, don't, I don't know if I... I never know. You have to cover the grave back up? Absolutely. You have to bury the bones, man. There's our fucking car. Soon it will be ours. See you around, Smitty. Can't do anything with the car right now, but we can go kill Metzger and the slave uh, boys. Drop a quick save? Yeah, let's do it. There you go. Polo, that was just for you. Wait. 
fuck's my bozer? Give it to me. Drop this key. Do not need it. Wrecked. Nice. Nicotine vaping in to see if uh, the light's not on, signifying that it should be done charging. I feel like there's something wrong with it. Well, uh, let's find out. shit back up. Is it on here? There we go. Okay. Shoot this guy. This guy on the ground. See if this vape wants to work. Alright, let's plug her in. Nope, still flashing red. Yep, I'll have to go to the store for that. Damn it. It's like when I had to go back to fucking Navarro. Zapped. Nice try, bud. You're fucking next. Okay. Oops, hit that guy way over there instead of this one that I was aiming at. involved. Metzger has a bunch of weird shit on him. A couple of flowers.
Okay, then we free the slaves here. Okay, and now Vic is on our team. I don't need to take it all, Maniac. I don't know if I turn that shit back into Mom from delivering the meal to Smitty. But heading towards Vault City is fine. Give the new one a gun. Uh, what, Vic? He should have a gun, and I don't have any on me that not only he's efficient at, but that I'm not using. So uh, he'll be all right. <laughs> he'll he'll be okay. Yeah, I like that running uh, sprite too. Oh, and the ones with the hands in the air. Oh, we got a special encounter. Ooh, bridgekeeper robes. Bridge Keeper Rose. Yeah, don't worry, Chris, I got it. We, uh, we did it. Oh, really? But, uh, once we get... Over towards Vault City and Modoc. I'll probably wrap the stream up because I'm going to have to end up going to the fucking store over this vape thing. I want to get that out of the way. Um, but we'll likely have another stream tomorrow. Uh, we're definitely going to be continuing the Red Dead 2 100% run. So there's that to look forward to. And we can even finish this playthrough if we want to. But I play through Fallout and Fallout 2 all the time on stream, so... Yeah, Vic's grabbing guns right now. He's gonna go. Nice. Yeah, Chris uh, Haynes, uh, it, Fallout 2 is fantastic, and I'm glad to see people enjoying it as much as I do in 2024. Alright, bada bing bada boom. But we should, I was going to say hit Modoc. Or whatever, far before we hit Vault City. What's in the cave? Sometimes it is filled with Deathclaws and, and Darl. Okay, Modoc is a perfect place to uh, end the stream here, and uh, I'll end up seeing you guys on the next one. Does my vape pen have a button? Yeah, I'm using a MyPod. <sighs> M-I-Pod, dash pod P O D. Um, I'm pretty sure I did everything right. It's just, uh, defective or something, man. It's not, uh, it's not wanting to, because I charged it and everything. Usually they come, like, half-charged. I don't know what its deal is. My normal just vape pin for THC is working just fine. 
And no, usually for uh, the MyPod, you turn it on, then you just suck on the bad boy. Give a shotgun to Vic. Yeah, we'll we'll get some weapons for everybody when uh, we continue the stream, uh, the 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 run here. So thank you guys very much for. Um, I'll leave the character sheet open while we do this. For joining me on the stream, um, I really appreciate everybody coming out. To the people who uh, did super chats and uh, gifted memberships, Nukeman, HPZ, Eduardo, Dick Pinasecki, and Adam ER, you guys are uh, fantastic. Thank you very much for the support. Make sure to follow me on Twitch. I'm trying to grow it over there, so uh, give me a follow over yonder if you haven't already. And uh you came at the end. Yeah, we'll we'll stream again. I might stream again tonight, but I definitely will be streaming tomorrow. So we'll uh, we'll have some stuff going. We'll finish this one up for sure. Uh, maybe we'll just finish this one up tonight. I don't know. But uh, yeah, thank you guys for coming out. I hope to catch you on the next one. It has been Mantis. Mm -hmm.